Whether you are currently living in Pittsburgh, thinking about moving to Pittsburgh, or just visiting Pittsburgh, you have to eat and there is no better meal in Pittsburgh than breakfast. Come check out our top five places for breakfast in Pittsburgh. Hi, my name is Mark McClinchy and welcome to my channel, Mark Knows Pittsburgh. Most of the time, I am here talking about neighborhoods, schools, and places to live for people considering a move to Pittsburgh. But today, I am bringing you a list of my family's favorite places to grab breakfast in the Pittsburgh area. Every weekend, we head out to look for a new place to try breakfast. We did a quick highlight of our meal on scene, even when it was sometimes in our car getting takeout due to COVID. If you search for the best breakfast in Pittsburgh, you might find Pamela's, DeLuca's, The Doorstop, or maybe even Eaton Park. All fine establishments, but perhaps predictable. We hope you'll find at least one, maybe more, places on our top five list that you have never been to. Try it out and let us know in the comments what you think. Let's get started with the top five breakfast spots in Pittsburgh. Starting off our list is the Federal Galley, which is located on the north side in the former Allegheny Center Mall. This food hall has a great indoor and outdoor atmosphere and plenty of options from four different kitchens, each with a unique concept. All right, we are at Federal Galley in the north side and we ordered from, I forget the names of the places, they've got four different restaurants here. You just walk up and order or you can do it on your phone but a couple different kitchens, lots of different options. Let's go around and see what everybody has. All right, Mia's first. <laughs> okay, so I got the Monte Cristo, um, and it's re it's really, really good. Um, and the fries are nice, and it has ham and bacon and Swiss and scrambled eggs, and it's delicious. And then there's this, which we kind of destroyed, but it was a sticky bun, and it like, has like caramelized crystal sugar on the top and like this amazing like frosting and maple syrup everywhere. Oh, it's so good. Yeah. And then I have this um, potato hash with eggs on top. It's delicious. Um, and so let's see. Are you ready now, Sadie? Yeah. I also got the Monte Cristo. And I, I don't know if she said, but it's um, it has French toast as, as uh, um, bread. Nice. And then Dan, I don't know if I got I got the bacon egg Sammy thingy. It's really good and has like very good like Tastes. Well, there you have a great report. <laughs> Federal Galley, though, it's really good. They, they've got, it looks like a cool place to hang out at night as well. Like, for there's a bar there. And so, anyway, oh, I also got a Bloody Mary, so why not? Um, have a great day. Going to the Strip District is an experience in itself and a must do for anyone visiting Pittsburgh. Located across from Penn Mac on the 2100 block of Penn Avenue, you will find Cafe Raymond. Here is our quick review, along with a bonus review of Defer Coffee. All right, everyone, this weekend we went down to the Strip District. We went to Defer Coffee and Tea for some drinks, and we went to Cafe Raymond for breakfast takeout, super easy to order. Their online ordering system was awesome, easy to customize stuff. So let's see how everyone's food is. So I got over medium eggs with sauteed spinach and some tomatoes and toast. And yeah, it's really good. It's cooked well, it's not a runny oak. Nice. Good. All right, girls back here, Sadie, Danny. Um, I got croissant with ham, egg and cheese. Um, It's pretty good, but it needs a little bit more flavor. I got an egg, bacon and cheese croissant and potatoes, and they're really, it is really good. It's just very oily. Oh yeah, the potatoes or the? The potatoes are good. The potatoes the, are good, the but the croissant's, croissant's really oily. The croissant's a little oily, and okay. And for the drink, we yeah. both got um, iced caramel latte. I give it a six out of 10, because there's not that much caramel. Nice, okay. Ooh, six out of 10, all right. Mm -hmm. Mia, we'll do your drink. Okay, I got um, the same thing, a caramel latte, but it comes with oat milk, and I really like it. All right, sweet. All right, my meal from Cafe Raymond is a um, brisket hash with over easy eggs, and it is delicious. I uh, gotta say, for takeout, I mean, really phenomenal. Came with barbecue sauce, I got it on the side. I was a little hesitant to throw that on there, but I'll try that in a minute. Uh, and my drink, I just got a Cortado from Defer, and it was great too. All right, everyone, have a great week. Bye. If you are looking for a unique breakfast made with fresh and organic ingredients, 
sourced from local farms, then you have to check out Farmer Baker. You can find Farmer Baker in Aspinwall at the Allegheny River Trail Park, as well as their second locations a few miles up the road at 1101 Powers Run in Fox Chapel. Apologies for mispronouncing the name in the video. All right, we are down on the Aspinwall Riverfront. We, there's a small stand down here called Baker Farmer delicious food and we just got it to go but we were hanging out along the river beautiful sunny day people are out walking boating uh so it's very cool so how about the food i got a plain bagel um, and cream cheese and they're fresh homemade and they're delicious homemade bagels nice i got everything bagel with mushrooms um cheese and egg very good and i also got the lemon cake nice it's also that's really, really good, good. We also got a drink, this like pink limeade drink. It was delicious, got some flowers in it. Um, I got a plain bagel, egg, cheese, and ham, and it's really good. Like, really nice. Good. Yeah, I got the same thing. I got egg, cheese, and uh, ham. Uh, good stuff, Baker Farmer. Really Thumbs good. up. Really good. Our on-site review definitely does not do justice to the phenomenal breakfast we had at Don's Diner. Located under the Ohio River Boulevard overpass in Marshall Shadeland, Don's Diner is easy to miss. This is an old school diner that in many ways represents the best of Pittsburgh. Great food, great people, and anything but pretentious. Do yourself a favor and plan a trip to Don's Diner. All right, hey everyone, we are at Don's Diner uh, in Marshall Shadeland on the north side, so we've got a great diner. Uh, what do you got, City? Pancakes, croissant, bacon, and egg. How is it? Good. All right. I have a um, wet Judy, so the wet Judy is very good. Um, what do you got, City? Danny, I got a bacon egg, bagel. This is a cool little vibe. Just come check it out. Five stars on Yelp. And after trying dozens and dozens of different breakfast joints all over Pittsburgh, our number one pick might be a surprise, Lola's Eatery, which is located just a stone's throw from the Doughboy statue in Lower Lawrenceville on Penn Avenue. We have had multiple visits to Lola's for breakfast and it is a home run every time. Speaking of home runs, be sure to check out the Pittsburgh icon in the background of our video. A museum dedicated to the great one is right next to Lola's. Hi right. guys. Go I'm ahead. going first. Yep. Excuse the mess on my face. Uh, we don't have any options. But we're at Lola's today. Where is it? Lawrenceville? Lawrenceville, strip district between. It's really good. So I got a plain bagel with um, a fried egg and cheese and bacon, avocado, and a garlic and herb spread. I think this is the best breakfast. Breakfast? Breakfast? Sandwich? Sandwich <laughs> that I've ever had. Nice. <laughs> okay, yeah. um, I, I ate it all, but I got to build your own for the plain bagel egg and cheese and bacon and it was very good the bacon was delicious the egg awesome it was very good 10 out of 10. Nice. so i got avocado toast as you can see it's a thick layer of avocado with um some onions tomatoes olive oil arugula and it's delicious it's so so good all right we also did an order of um what was it egg, breakfast, breakfast egg, egg rolls, rolls. That was the best thing on the menu and, and they're gone they were delicious um and so yeah i got a breakfast sandwich with sausage uh, on a red chili bagel, delicious. So Lola's, big thumbs up. Very good. So which one of these breakfast spots are you going to try? And if you are visiting Pittsburgh or looking for fun things to do, then check out one of my most popular videos about the best things to do in Pittsburgh. Or if you are planning a trip to Pittsburgh, then you'll definitely want to check out this video to help plan your visit. And if you need help buying a home in the Pittsburgh area, please get in touch as soon as possible. My availability is filling up fast. Thanks for watching and see you in the next video.